Hi, Steve Gordon here, your friendly neighborhood Carson carpet repair expert. And if you need your carpet stretched, you've come to the right place. I've made this video to answer all your questions all about carpet stretching. Now, if you need any more help after you've watched the video, well, feel free to give us a call and we'll be just thrilled to take your call, answer all your questions, and then come on out and fix your carpet if that's what you'd like us to do. So again, I'm Steve Gordon. I hope to hear from you soon, so please call. Meanwhile, I hope you enjoy learning all about carpet stretching. Hi, Steve here, Creative Carpet Repair. So if you have some questions about carpet stretching, it's probably because you've got some ripples in your carpet. You can call them waves or bumps or bulges, but for one reason or another, you're looking at your carpet and you see that it goes like this. You might just have one, one ripple right down the middle. You, it could be waves and ripples all over your carpet. And you probably have some questions, and I'll try to answer a few of them. One question people ask is, how did this happen? Why is my carpet doing this? And the answer is more than likely that it wasn't stretched in properly to begin with. You see, what we use for carpet stretching is a power stretcher. If we use a power stretcher, we can stretch the carpet so tight that it'll never come up again. You see, a power stretcher butts up against one wall, it goes all the way across the room, and it um, has a head on the other side. And when we push down that lever, man, it stretches that carpet tight. So we give you a 100% unlimited, unconditional, lifetime labor guarantee that that carpet it will never need to be stretched again if you go ahead and hire us to restretch your carpet. Another question people generally have is, how much will it cost to have your carpet stretched? If that's you, you come to the right place. What we normally do is wait for you to call, and then we'll give you a general ballpark guesstimate over the phone. It'll be a price range, and we won't really know how much it is until we show up. But some factors that might contribute to whether or not it'll be more or less expensive would be certainly the size of the room or the rooms. Do we need to take apart seams and put seams back together? Um, how much furniture there is to move? Do we need to move anything real, real heavy? Um, maybe there's a piano or a pool table or up or downstairs, that sort of thing. So give us a call here. We can come on out and give you that absolutely free, no obligation bid. Do the job right then and there and back it up forever, and then, like I said, life is good. So give us a call. Thank you very much, and um, by the way, thank you for watching my video. Bye-bye. Hi, Steve here. So you've got some questions about carpet patching or else you probably wouldn't be watching this recording. I'll try to answer a few of the most frequently asked questions about carpet patching right now. So the first thing people usually wonder about carpet patching is what's the patch going to look like? I mean, after all, is it going to be something that's visible from across the room or is it going to be more or less invisible? And the answer to that first question is maybe. Maybe yes, maybe no. It's really impossible for me to know if the patch is going to be visible or not. You see, there are certain factors, actually there's quite a few factors that can contribute to whether or not you're going to see a patch. For example, if you, you have a, a worn carpet in one area, maybe it's threadbare or maybe it's faded by the sunshine, maybe it's soiled, and you take a new piece of carpet and you patch that new piece of carpet right into where it's threadbare or worn or faded, well, certainly you will see that patch. However, it's going to look a lot better than what you're probably looking at right now if you're looking at having your carpet patched. If your dog or cat try to dig its way out of a room, you've got an issue, and this is probably going to look a lot, lot better. Um, another reason why a patch might be visible is if the nap of the carpet is very short. So if you've got very short nap carpet, 
it's going to show the seams more than a thick nap carpet. When I was a kid back in the 70s doing this work, uh, we had shag, shag carpet. I mean, you could lose your car keys in there. You could lose your whole car in that carpet. It was so, so long and thick. Um, I mean, we had shag carpet that was, <laughs> it was like that. And um, if, if we put a patch there, it, it wouldn't matter. If, if There could be a gap that's a quarter inch wide in that patch, and you would never even see it. It would look perfect. Uh, you could do those patches blindfold. But now, with this carpet that's narrow or short, short nap, or even the, the loops of a Berber weave, boy, if that carpet um, isn't 100% perfect, it's going to stand out like crazy. And even if it is 100% perfect, you're likely to see the patch. Now, the rows, well, what I should say actually is the, the cuts that go along the same direction as the nap of the carpet, those seams generally look better than the cross seams going across the, the nap. Um, so th those are a few reasons why you might see a patch. Now, if everything's the same, if you have a, a nice new carpet and you have a nice new carpet to do the patch with, it's going to look a lot better than, than the mismatch. Another question people ask us is, do you have the carpet to do the patch with? And I say, no, um, we, we don't go shopping for carpet for you. We, generally speaking, need you to supply the carpet. So if you don't have any leftover from the installation, we'll ask you if we could take the carpet from a closet. Now, if you don't have it in a closet and you don't have it left over from the installation, I'm sorry, there's probably nothing we can do for you. So hopefully you'll have the carpet to do the patch with. Now, the other thing people are wondering is how much is it going to cost? And I'll try to answer that right now. Um, if you call us, you're going to give us a general idea what a carpet, um, how much work it's going to be to do the carpet patch for you. We're going to give you a ballpark figure, something between, we might say between 150 and 350. So it's going to be a wide window for how much we want to charge. Um, if you feel like it's somewhere in the, in the realm of what's fair, then we can come to your home or office and give you an actual bid. Then, at that point, if you feel the price is fair, we're ready to do the job right then and there, all in one trip. Um, finally, the guarantee. How long is the patch going to last? Well, we back up our work forever with a 100% unlimited, unconditional lifetime labor guarantee. That means that I guarantee, I promise, that for the life of your carpet and you, well, I guarantee the patch. So you and your carpet will be completely worn out before you ever have any issue at all with that patch. So I'm Steve Gordon. I'm the carpet repair guy. I'm certainly not an actor. Everybody can see that for sure. I'm just a carpet guy trying to answer a few questions. The next thing to do is to give us a call at the office, office and uh, let us know what you're dealing with so we can help you from there. Um, we can come out and take care of everything, and then life is good, you know? So there you have it. Steve Gordon, give me a call. Thanks. Bye-bye.